Just here with Bluey this morning. Just going to uh, wash the truck. I was meant to drive the truck in this morning. My first time, but uh, I was having car problems. I couldn't get to his place early enough. So I missed out on that. It's bloody cold, everything's frozen. Which is why I didn't get here, because my car was playing up. Hey? <laughs> Water frozen? No, nah, not the GoPro, just the normal camera. GoPro wasn't charged. So we're just down here at um, Bridgestone in Benalla. Get it washed, he's got to go back to the sign riders. Uh, they buggered up the um, sign riding on the side there, so they've got to redo it. Yeah, alright. So there'll be um, there'll be some die cast in this video. I think we're going to get some cast later on. So uh, just bear with us. We'll get this truck washed first. So if we can find a hose that's not frozen. Big Mac. Patterns in the clouds up there. All right. All right, the truck is the truck is half washed. Washed enough for the sign rider to fix up his mistakes. So now gonna go and drop it off at the sign riders. I just found out it was minus three at the moment. That's why the hose was frozen. some more die cast cars from a uh, lady that uh, she used to have a shop and she, uh, she closed down the shop a few years ago and uh, now she's just trying to get rid of her stuff um, got onto it through uh, through Bluey there and um, yeah, so we picked some stuff up, went to the um, store.
storage uh, storage unit that she's got where she stores it all. I didn't do any uh, didn't do any filming there. Um, just keep that private. So uh, yeah, so no one tries to get in there. But uh, yeah, managed to pick a few things up, some really good stuff, which I'll show you later. And uh, yeah, and then put some stuff aside for next week. So we'll uh, we'll get that then. So yeah, so that's pretty good. But, uh, at the moment, I'm just heading home. home through uh, Lake McCohen. Well, good day everyone, back at home. <clears throat> um, it's actually the day day after or night after of what you've seen um, in the first part of the video um, had a few things to do last night so I uh, didn't have a chance to film once I got home um, but yeah I thought I'd give you a look now at the things that I picked up yesterday um, <clears throat> and some stuff during the week so we'll turn around some things I picked up yesterday were a uh, two-pack um, Batman Begins. Uh, was it the Tumblr? I think it is. <clears throat> uh, and the black and the camo, so I picked that up. Um, the Mini Champs Audi TT. Um, I was actually given that one. Um, 143 scar, which I definitely wasn't going to knock back, and this cool Mazda Mazda RX3 and 143 scar, which I'll do separate videos on them. Um, 118 scar Land Rover Discovery, um, that's in green. Uh, we pick up a, a grey one or charcoal coloured one in another few weeks um, so yeah I've seen that and I thought well I've got to have it unfortunately it's not grey but uh, anyway um, and then a Road Rats here uh, a Chrysler P2 Cruiser I had uh, she had a few of them there but um, I, the, the, the other ones that she'd had I'd already had those so there was no point getting them again um, and then these are just finds from uh, from Coles and Big W and things, so I've been so I finally found one, the uh, 32 Ford, which I wanted. So and this the uh, was 57 GMC step side. So I picked that up, and then yesterday I got this, um, which is a um, oh, who was it? I think Bob Jane uh, Camaro. It's a 143 scale uh, resin. Um, resin model, which I'll uh, uh, give you a quick look. That's from Armco. So that's it there. So yeah, that's that's a nice piece. That one I had to have it. Yep, me mate found that one in, uh, in her collection, and uh, yeah, as soon as he opened it up, I I had to have it. I said that's mine. <laughs> it's from the uh, Australian Touring Car Championship Series from 1971. Model number one. Okay, so I'll do a separate video on that. She originally had it uh, when she had her uh, die car store for 110. Uh, I looked today on eBay and uh, 
It was one there for a hundred and was I think it was a hundred and fifty or a hundred and sixty or something. Uh, it was the only one I could find on there. Um, that one was signed though, but uh, yeah, I only paid fifty or something dollars for that one, so I wasn't going to pass that up. So yeah. So I'm definitely the old uh, Mazda here, I like that one. It was one of 3,000 pieces, that one. And then the uh, Audi was one of 1,600. Yeah, I looked at uh, looked today and these are still going for, well, I found one on eBay for $117 or something. So uh, yeah, that's a, a good one to the collection. And uh, yeah, so then the uh, the Batman ones there. I'll end up taking these out of this uh, this this case. So it's a bit torn up the top here, and got the price tags on it of previous prices. So I'll, I'll take them out. I'm not worried about the case too much. So so that's those. That's what I picked up uh, yesterday. I put another couple aside. So uh, next week I've got another two 118 scales coming, um, another uh, 32 Ford um, and a uh, Corvette as well, um, then I'll put a couple other things aside. So we'll pick all that up next week. Alright, so that's it for this, uh, that's it for this video. So I'll do... Um, I'll do some separate videos on all those. Um, I'll probably start tonight. Um, I'll actually, the other thing I've got too was some uh, some paint. Um, I don't know if that's what you guys use to, uh, you know, customise your die cast and things. But I thought, well, I've got to start there somewhere, and I've got some got some brushes, just some thin ones refine ones because I want to do some headlights um, just start something simple um, you know like something like that there it's um it just needs some color you know brake lights and headlights if I can just start with doing that um, well that'll be fine uh, it just adds, adds to the look of it so is um yeah when you display them you want to you want it to look a little bit better, you know. So yeah, so some you know headlights on that would certainly look a lot better than what it does now. And most of the time, headlights are a, you know a silvery metallic type of colour. But uh, if you have any other suggestions about what colour, uh, you know, headlights, tail lights, or what paint um, to use. Um, let me know because I uh, I guess I want to do a bit more of it well I haven't even started yet so when I start I want to do more of it um, so I think it will make it look a lot better I'm not going to I don't think I'll ever go crazy and do you know wheel swaps and all that sort of stuff um, at the moment I'll just keep it with the headlights and tail lights and a few other details so if anyone's got any ideas, let us know on what to use. I'm sure there's probably videos on on the old YouTube there um, with uh, some you know, good details, but I'll get on to that. Alright, um, so that's it. hope you enjoyed that video. Yeah, the reason I done the, uh, had the truck there on the start of this video is I was, I was meant to get there earlier, get to my mate's place earlier, which is over the other side of the lake. Uh, yeah, get there early, and I was going to drive the truck into town. Um, but I was having car troubles myself, so I couldn't get there in time, and he needed to get there at a certain time. So, anyway, so next time, probably next weekend, I'll take the truck out for a drive. Um, so I'm going to go and get my license, and uh, yeah, start driving trucks. So it should be good. Um, yeah, so uh, so that'll be all right. 
I uh, look forward to doing that. Um, certainly something different to uh, have on the old uh, videos there, some, some truck videos. But uh, yeah, I'll do a bit more of that whenever I do get a chance to take the truck out for a drive. I'll uh, get it on camera and uh, show you all. Alright, well that's it for now. I might uh, start doing some uh, some cracking videos here, uh, some unboxing. So I'm hanging to get this stuff out, look at it a bit better. Alright, until then, I hope you enjoyed the video. Um, please like, uh, subscribe, and comment. Um, yeah, things are going pretty good at the moment with all that. Um, but yeah, a few more comments and likes and things, and that'd be great. Um, yeah, it'd be much appreciated. Get the uh, get the channel up and running, and uh, yeah, it might help me uh, get out and get some more uh, diecast. Um, yeah, good for everyone. Alright, we'll see you later. Bye.